China dialing back coronavirus conspiracy claims, U.S. says earlier this month a Chinese foreign ministry spokesman, Xiao Ligin, suggested on Twitter that the U.S. military may have brought the new coronavirus to Wuhan, the metropolis where cases were first detected late last year. Washington, China has retreated from spreading conspiracy theories online in the developing world alleging U.S. involvement in the coronavirus pandemic after finding limited traction, a U.S. official said Friday. The State Department's Global Engagement Center, which is in charge of analyzing and countering foreign propaganda, said China has shifted to praising its own successes in containing the virus and highlighting its delivery of aid abroad. We assess that the PRC official messaging in Africa shows that they may have abandoned that disinformation campaign specifically saying that coronavirus had originated in the U.S., said Lee Gabriel, the coordinator of the center. We're also seeing something similar in the Western Hemisphere, she told reporters. She said that analysis of Chinese government social media postings from the 13th to the 15th of March showed mostly negative reactions in Africa to the conspiracy theory. Earlier this month a Chinese foreign ministry spokesman, Xiao Ligin, suggested on Twitter that the U.S. military may have brought the new coronavirus to Wuhan, the metropolis where cases were first detected late last year. The State Department called the conspiracy theory ridiculous and summoned the Chinese ambassador. President Donald Trump later cited the episode for his controversial use of the term Chinese virus to describe the new coronavirus, which has sickened more than half a million people around the world. Gabrielle said that China has also promoted on social media its accusation that Trump's terminology is racist. China has increasingly welcomed discussion of the epidemic, which constituted about 60% of its official social media postings in Africa in mid-March, up from no discussion at all in early January, she said. China has made a concerted effort to build a social media following to convince people that they're acting responsibly in providing aid, Gabriel said. She said Russia continued to be the major concern. In assessments provided last month to AFP, the Global Engagement Center said thousands of Russian-linked social media accounts have run a coordinated campaign to undermine official narratives, including by alleging U.S. involvement. We are still seeing the Kremlin continue its reckless attempt to propagate disinformation, Gabriel said. Please save the trees and nature, please subscribe my channel. Thank you.